difficult task in excel is comparing two sheets like i have this two sheets where the value is not matching and i have to compare them what i told you you can prepare make a auto reconciliation master by using simple 365 formulas which will give you not only the variance between two in one list but also extract the specific invoices where there is a difference so want to suppose here i have this list and i get the only variance where there is a difference so out of this invoices only these are the 13 invoices where there is difference so that i can so without wasting time let's jump into it how can i have done this so i'm just removing my all the formula which i have done right now so first for the getting the total list i required all the invoices number which are coming in data 1 data 2 i can have data 3 also but for making it simple i have added only two data i will start with v stack what v stack will do it will combine these two arrays and give this in you know, one row so my first array is this data 1 so this is my table where in all invoice numbers are there so i will select this so it's always better to have your database in a table format it's not then you have to select the range this is table 1 then data 2 is in table 2 so these two invoices are stacked in this row so 63 number but the issue is that some invoices are coming duplicate so it will create difficulty in uh, maintaining a reconciliation so i can use the unique formula which will give me the list of only unique list so if i just enter unique my array is this v stack formula if i press enter see the list get reduced to only 29 invoices so i will get the list of unique invoices only now i want the data one values for this unique list so i will type some if s sorry some if s some ranges this invoice number comma and my criteria is this invoice uh some if i start with the range which i want i have start with a uh, invoice amount and now my criteria range is invoice number i will search this invoices in this list and now being excel is a dynamic formula i have entered this formula only in cell number b6 if i want to refer that formula i will type hash If I type this hash and press enter, I will get the all the invoices number. If any new invoice number is added, for example, I will add some new invoice one one seven one. One way to automatically add it. And one more thing we can also do with invoice number, we can sort this invoice numbers so that we can the list in array is this. my index is 1 and sorting is in ascending order if i press enter i will get the list of invoices in a sorting order and the values i will add a sum so that i will track what the value is now again dynamic magic hash key and get the sum key so i don't have to worry about the range where the formula is i have to just mention the range just check data 1 total is 96 Nine two six two three six zero six. Yes, that's right. Now data two value. I will type sum if as formula. Sum range is this invoices list, and then criteria is this invoice number, comma, and rico is this invoice number, and then magic hash key. Bracket close. Done. So here it is giving the list formula copied. I will get the list of nine four three two six. Now I want variance, so this C minus D, but I don't copy paste. So it's better C hash minus D hash. So automatically wherever the range is, it will give me the difference. So I will get that is a seventeen lakh difference between this two database and in these invoices are different, but it's very tough. Ki how many number of invoices difference? So I can extract only the invoices with the differences by using filter formula. I will type filter. My array is this invoice number. 
I will select this all range I will add to the maximum then I will go and select include so in this case I have to extract only the cases where variance is not equal to zero so I will mention the same thing like this this is my variance I will get it to 52 when this is not equal to zero bracket close see the magic so I know this 17 like difference is only in this 14 invoices not I have to go through all and this is my auto master now we can check this wait for a minute I can do one more thing here in the variance I want to show the top value above so I can sort this variance report also just type sort array is this my filter sort index is my fourth which is variance and the it is descending order minus one bracket close so I get the major differences in 40 lakh in this invoice so let me check so was 119 invoices not in database 2 if I will add this invoice here sorry it's a total so I will search here if I just see if I add in this data table it will remove from there Rico see it is removed the revised difference is available so just give the input in data one data two and you are ready with your Rico and you will analyze your difference variance very fast so anything that updated the update in the data one if it's there then recheck where is the reason of variance so hope you like you can also do this variance analyze with invoice state if there is a case of that one invoice or another financial year, I just show you how can you do that suppose in this case there is a invoice date condition is also there so simple way just as I have V stack in this V stack you have to stack this invoice number and date comma and data to invoice number and date bracket close what it will do right now this formula will be enter data it will stack I will change the format of invoice is to control shift 3 to date format now I will get the list of all the invoices so total list is 65 so there may be a case some unique list will be there so I will type unique formula so it will list down only the unique list for me so let me check so it is reduce it to 32 so I will get the unique list so I get the data value 1 by using some Mayfair formula where I will add first criteria is this invoice number invoice amount comma first criteria is invoice number criteria should be this range uh, sorry I will in the record to this I will have hash key to get the formula so second condition is so I don't think I will add hash because I have entered invoice number and date so I have to just select this range here then second is my invoice date so I will go to this invoice date comma my repo so here I will get the list of all the invoices here and I will add some formula here so I will get the list of data 1 9 2 2 6 and same way I will add for data 2 I will add sum if s Some range is this I will start from the top otherwise I have not capture the table format sum if s criteria range is invoice number comma so my record to is this invoice number comma then second condition is invoice date 
comma this number uh, sorry in yz bracket close just the formula copy paste so i will get the list of invoices in table 2 986 and i will get the variance report this minus this and it will give me the list of variance so it's difference of 57 lakh and i will get the list it by using the filter formula wherever there is a variance so i can easily analyze where the reason or variance is in this for uh, five to six invoices and i can easily now review what can i do for this so hope you like this video please uh if you want much more video please in the comment box you type on which topic you want more video thanks for watching